cook it, cut it, measure it, bag it, sell it, cook it, cut it, measure it, measure it, crack. Here go the Merrow's lineup. You guys can see the difference between some of the other stores. Definitely a solid Air Jordan retro lineup right here. Same thing with the basketball section. A lot of shoes on sale here too as well. There's more of the basketball section here as well. So this is what we came for. The AE1. Got these in men's sizes right here. Let me know what you guys think about this colorway, man. The new wave. Some people like it. Is this better than the first colorway? It is very cold. And uh, shout out to the people let me know that they use my video to help them lace swap. Put the white laces in here, you're definitely set. I'm sure white laces will go really hard in here. If you guys put white laces in yours, go ahead and send me some pictures on Instagram or something like that or on the Discord. We got a different colorway of the Curry 11. Don't recall, don't recall seeing these anytime recent. It's not a bad silhouette and they got some pretty decent colorways. Uh, 160 on the retail for these. Definitely my first time seeing this color combination. Materials in the upper is definitely on point. Still full retail at 140. Materials are very solid as well. Another New Balance basketball shoe. Let me know if you guys are feeling this one. 120 on the retail. First time seeing like this oil green or army green 1906. Let me know if you guys are feeling either or not. Back again here at the Culver City Mall, Westfield. Let's go ahead and see what we got. Champs, Chic, Foot Locker, and JD Sports. First stop, let's go ahead and see what's inside Champ Sports. Right when you walk in, they got a sales table with some Crocs over here. I think everything's going for like 29 bucks over here. Pretty decent selection. Now we got some of the GT Cut Academies and some colorways I have yet to see. New, uh, newest Nike budget model sneaker, only $90 on the retail for these. Also got the black and white one as well, or white with the black, right next to the first game, LeBron Next Gens. Then we got some retros, including the most recent release right here, Jordan 6, Ochres. Not a bad color combination. Let me know if you guys are a fan of these or not, still full retail at 200 bucks. Now let me know which one you guys like more, the Jordan 1 Ochre or the Jordan 6. You know, the Jordan, both of them have actually some really good leather quality on them. It's just a preference, I guess. Got a new colorway of the Westbrook One Take 5. Not a bad shoe right here. 100 on the retail, this is his budget model. Then they have this black, white, and red one, of course, like a bread theme. Translucent parts are also $100 on these as well. Let me know what you guys think about Westbrook shoes overall. And they got these on deck, man. Super clean, you can never go wrong with a pair of the original Shaqs. These on deck too, which are pretty dope. The NXT LeBrons, 110 on the retail. 139, we need to find these for cheaper in size 13. Terrascape Air Max 90s down to 69 bucks. Normally like 180 on these, I think. Something like that. And they have both colorways, the new wave and the for love colorway of the AE1s. Which colorway or which one do you guys like more? Both of these are pretty solid and there are some more colorways on the way for the AE1s. But let me know what you guys think about these two. And they have some of the latest colorways of the Puma MB03. We're in the grade school section though. Let me know if you guys are feeling any one of these colorways more than others. But of course, my favorite is this Dexter's Laboratory. We do have a full detail review plus lacing tutorial and lace swapping because these come with extra laces. I'm not so sure about the Chinese New Year or these other ones, but lace swapping on all of these would definitely be on point. Then we got the wall over here with all the Adidas stuff. We've seen a lot of this stuff before. This one I haven't seen though. This one with the iridescent on the boost. You can never go wrong with that. $160 on the retail for these. This Champ Sports definitely has a great selection of sneakers. The AE1s and both colorways, the Puma MBO 3 some Trey Young 3s, as well as some nice Pumas. Nothing that we haven't really seen already, but let me know what you guys think about the selection here. Hopefully you guys are having a great day wherever you are in the world. Welcome my Timu jumpsuit once again. If you guys wanna know more details about this and everything else I got from Timu, go ahead and check out that video or either hit the link in the description box, you dig? Let's go ahead and check out this Foot Locker. This is the location where I found them hats for like four bucks. Let's see if there's any more crazy deals in here. As soon as you walk in, you got some must-haves. Pretty nice selection here. Pandas, Dunks, Jordan 1 Lows. What do you guys think about this color combination on the New Balance 9060 on the women's side? Not a bad colorway. NMD V3. Let me know if you guys are feeling this colorway or not. $140 on the retail. Over to the hats real quick. We got these down 19 bucks now. I think these were $4.99 before. 
19 for that. What we got back here? 29 bucks. What's this tag? 19 bucks. 4.99 might be gone. More hats down here. 29 bucks. Going on up. Yeah. 4.99 is gone. Half of the basketball section, pretty much the same things we've seen before. No new silhouettes. Now this basketball section over here is looking pretty mean. Of course. Telling you, you don't find this I Promise colorway too many locations, man. These are actually pretty dope. Let me know if you guys are a fan of this I Promise Nike LeBron Next Gen. 170 on the retail, so they went up on the retail tag for them. One's dope. First game. This is that new ADMP LeBron Next Gen. These are the original Next Gens. Of course, they got the LeBron 20s, Ablon Pearl, Conkylin. They got the Algae. A lot of dope colorways for the LeBron next gen. And of course we got some KD16s. This bad colorway is one of the ones a lot of people are looking for. This store has them. A few locations had a bad colorway, but not many locations do. Then they got the KD16 Wanda. Let me know if you guys are a fan of this one or not. Of the other Jordans, we got Lucas here, Jordan Legacies. Nothing that we haven't seen before, even some Tatums. Jordans, we got Jordan 1s, Jordan 2s, Jordan 5s, 14s. Really good selection of retros over here as well. Jordan 2 Pythons. Jordan 1 Gore-Tex, one of the best colorways. Got the Orcas and the Jordan 1 Royal Reimagines with the mauve colorway in the back. Once again, really good materials. All black with the white detailing. You can never go wrong with that. Get Clipper merch over here. A lot of the clothing apparel is stuff that we have seen at other locations. Haven't seen this at too many locations. The one that looked like a paint splatter over them. Jordan on the back right there with the six rings. 88 bucks on that. Got the soul food on sale for 29 bucks. That's a pretty dope theme. Anything on the back? Oh, that is the back. Serve fresh soul food. I like that graphic right there, that's pretty dope. Everything else here we pretty much have seen before. And the Nike Tech in the blue and green colorway. Definitely solid, but we have seen it before. AE1s over here too. So far, both stores we've been to have the AE1s on deck. Let me know if you guys are a fan of this colorway. The combination on the form lows, pretty solid, still 100 on the retail. Simpsons creeping around here, one of the best color combinations and, co and you know collabs on the Adidas form low. One of my favorite colorways on these 2002 R's. These are pretty solid for the new balances. Not sure if this is a colorway we've seen before. I feel like it's slightly different from some of the other colorways. Still full retail. And I'm telling you, these 720s definitely are not bad, man. This colorway is pretty dope. Let's go ahead and check out JD Sports. Same retro selection here. They also have mauve colorways down to 140 as well. First time seeing this colorway on the Jordan 1 low. Let me know if you got a feeling these or not. White with the cell and brown, along with that University Blue detailing on the swoosh and wings logo. Pretty solid. I'm a fan of this Jordan 1 low here too. The materials on here are definitely impressive. And these Jordan 1 low crafts are pretty solid as well. Still full retail at 125. And they do got these on deck, Jordan 1 low OGs. This is a big size. This has to be like a 13 or a 14. Or Jordan Retros. Lucas still 90 bucks. We need those to go a little lower. Tatum's on sale too. $100 on the retail for these. They still got the Chinese New Year's on deck too. Definitely a solid colorway for sure. Same thing here when it comes to the Adidas section. I like these blue campuses though. Definitely nice color combination. Materials look pretty dope. 110 on the retail. Two different Romero's including the black colorway with that 3M poking out. But this lakeside is definitely dope. One of the best colorways so far, especially in 2024. $80 on the triple white Presto, definitely clean. This seems like a steal, normally 120 down to 30 bucks. $30 for these? JD Sports has slightly a different colorway on this 2002 R. Let me know if you guys are feeling these or not. Then we also saw these before. This location has some pretty nice shoes here. Good selection of colorways. Let me know your thoughts about these. They even have some 2002 R's marked down to 110. Sweet Air Force Ones, followed by this triple red. A lot of people do like these. Let me know if you are disgusted or is this a dope colorway. Second location with this yellow, black, and white color combination on the dunk low. Still full retail at 125. Pandas, Varsity Reds. Definitely a good selection of dunks here as well, but nothing new really, you dig? Just recently seen this colorway and already down to 120 bucks on these. Let me know what you guys think about this Air Max One. And that colorway is down to 120 also. Women's exclusive Dunk Low. Got that pink 
This is definitely some Valentine's Day stuff. $125 on the retail. Let me know what you guys think about this Jordan 1 low for the women. Definitely a Valentine's Day vibe. Satin and some leather, not good, not bad quality. These are down to 130 from 180, which is good, man. Hopefully they go down even more. Great selection of shoes here, but we gotta go on to the next store. And of course you got a bunch of clothes over here as well. Now we're gonna go inside Chic Shoes and see what we can come across in here. Of course, the gray school session, as soon as you walk in, always a really dope selection here with some shoes that's not around in most spots. Of course, because gray school's kind of sit, you dig? Let me know if you guys are feeling this Jordan 1 low here. Gray school exclusive, not a bad color combination for sure. They also have these with that stuff that moves around in a Nike swoosh. Definitely a gray school vibe, only on one side too. And it comes with a translucent outsole. Jordans inside the Jordan silhouette or section. A lot of things we've seen before, but there is one that's here that's uh, not around too often. They got these on deck, but this looks like a bigger size. I don't know if they have more sizes available or not, but good to still see these around. Of course, they have a smooth lineup of MVPs, but look at this one, bro. I know y'all be iffy on these MVPs. But what about this one here? This is definitely one of the best colorways. The materials are on point. Look at the suede on here. I know people want to clown these, man. But these are actually dope. Good materials. These are shitting on a lot of shoes out there, man. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Let me know what you think about these. Jordan 1 Lowe's, not a bad colorway on here. Still full retail. Stadium 90s, along with the 312 Legacies and the PSG. Very good colorway as well. They also still have this Gore-Tex on deck here. Still full retail. Oh, actually it's marked down. Normally 199 down to 139 on these. Then they got the other colorway that's off of fire too. Three of the most recent Gore-Tex Jordan ones that had released. Let me know which one you guys like the most. Kind of a tough decision, but I'll probably go one, two, three. But all of them are definitely impressive. What do you guys think about this color combination on this Jordan Comfort 2? Still full retail. Materials look pretty decent and that colorway is not bad at all. Bunch of Jordan Mids down here that we have seen. A couple of Jordan 1s, reverse laneys, and satin breads. Satin breads are still full retail or another markdown also. Normally 179 down to 134. <laughs> These must be marked down to 99 bucks. Then we got the uh, some more stuff down here. Have not seen this color combination on the Stadium 90s. Definitely a bread vibe. Some good materials on here too. And these definitely look solid, man. Second time seeing them in a the video. Maybe the girls out there watching might like this. Let me know what you guys think about these. Bunch of fire retros down here too. What are these going for? We see these marked down everywhere. 89 bucks. Normally 175 down to 89 bucks on these. That's clean right there. Got the women's Jordan 2 also with some great materials. Still full retail. But all these things are pretty much marked down. 89 bucks as opposed to 175 for this one as well. A lot of men would have grabbed this if they came in men's sizes. Jordan 2. 80 bucks as opposed to 175. What are these, man? 139 as opposed to 149. I understand why they only went down $10 because this is definitely one of the best ones of 2023 by far. Still full retail on the Apolitans. This Jordan 5 is 149 as opposed to the normal retail price. And how much did they have the Gore Texas? Normally 250 down to 219. These Pumas are pretty interesting right here. 80 bucks on a retail form. Let me know if you guys like these or not. Definitely solid. School Henderson's first shoe right here. Chris Brickley, actually Chris Brickley's edition. Let me know if you guys are a fan of Chris Brickley and what he does with the team, keep growing. I like the fact that they gave him a shoe though. He working out a lot of popular athletes for sure. The Gremlins edition of the Puma Nitro or All Pro One, definitely a solid colorway. You guys are a fan of the Gremlins, this might be the shoe for you. You got the little fur on the tongue right there. Very solid. Normally 149 down to 119 on the Reebok Blast. Definitely a classic shoe right here. 
Kobe Crazy 8s down to 89 bucks in the classic black and white colorway. This colorway of the Crazy 8 is down to 110 bucks. You definitely can't go wrong with this one at all. $99 on the Team Orange with that suede upper. Definitely a fire color combination on these for sure. And these are down to 119 from 149, which is super dope. Mostly this colorway of the camp is low. Too many spots, man. Definitely clean that gray with the black. Can't go wrong with these. This form low is definitely impressive right here. One, uh, 54 bucks as opposed to 119. Have yet to see this colorway <laughs> on the Nike Cortez. 90 bucks on the retail. Got that green suede. These are pretty clean. Got this canvas Air Force One, the tan with the black outsole, 125. They also got them in black with like a greenish midsole. Not too mad at these. Let me know if you guys are a fan. This color combination on the Air Force One is pretty solid too. And their basketball section is always on point from top to bottom. Let me go ahead because there's something up there we got to look at really quick. Of course, they got the Barclays, up tempos. But what's that one right there? Nice colorway on this Air Max up tempo one, man. Let me know what you guys think about these. Very, very dope and classic shoe. Give me your thoughts about this colorway here. Is there some 3M on it? Put some light on it to see if there was 3M, but there's actually no 3M on here, unfortunately. KD16 bad. Very nice selection of LeBron next gens or witness eights. Have yet to see this colorway on the LeBron witness eight. Definitely a wild colorway for sure right here. Let me know if you guys are a fan of these. This LeBron witness eight is crazy. I have not seen this colorway anywhere else. That's why I like to come to Chic and different Chic's because they have different colorways of shoes that you haven't seen anywhere else. This right here might be a 10 out of 10 in my opinion. Let me know what you guys think. LeBron 20 algae. This one which is also dope. On sale here now, 149. A lot of places got these on sale. Still full retail on this one, 200 bucks, but they got the I Promise Next Gen AWP or AMP, AWP, I think that's what it's called. The second generation of the LeBron Next Gen. Let me know what you guys think about. God damn. They also got the Next Gen LeBron, the I Promise colorway. Got the patent leather on the upper. Let me know if you guys are a fan of LeBron Next Gen. This one retails for 170 bucks. Very dope Nike basketball section here. You can't go wrong with what you see here, bro. We've seen the other colorways, the black one right behind it, but this one's also pretty clean. Still full retail on the Force. Then we got this one right here, which is a newer colorway also. Give me your thoughts about these in the comments below. New colorway on the Vapor Max Plus right here, still full retail 210. Very solid color combination. No, I'm not mad at these at all. Haven't seen this colorway of the Humera ever. I like this, haven't even seen it online yet. Very solid color combination on these though. Many locations have this on deck, man. This is definitely a solid colorway for sure. Let me know if you guys like these or not. On the women's side, they got some more creative Cortezes right here. Definitely solid. Let me know if you guys are a fan of these or not. They also have this green colorway with the suede upper as well on the women's side for 90 bucks also. Patent leather Air Force One. White, black, and gray with a hint of red. Give me your thoughts about these. Dunk section is pretty much what we've seen at all spots here. All locations, nothing really new, but there is a solid selection of dunks there. And I swear to God, man, out of all the places I've been to, this is the only location that still have these on deck. Definitely a clean colorway. Mean color combination on this Air Max 1 on a gray school side. These came out of men's sizes. Would you pick them up? 110 on the retail. Busy so far? Not too bad. Okay. Cook it, cut it, measure it, bag it, sell it. Cook it, cut it, measure it, measure it, crack. Cook it, cut it, measure it, bag it, sell it. Cook it, cut it, measure it, measure it, crack. That's that crack music. Crack. So that's crack, young <laughs> That's all you need. Crack. Cook it, cut it, measure it, bag it, sell it. Crack. Cook it, cut it, measure it. Three letters. Crack. That's that crack music. Crack. So that's crack, young <laughs> That's all you need. Crack. Cook it, cut it. Cut it, measure it, yeah, 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 yeah. cook it, cut yeah, it, measure yeah, yeah. it. Hey, yo, bro, who y'all think got the best handles, yo? Man, Kyrie off tops. Hold on, better than Jamal Crawford? What? Easy. 